Let's play knight c6. I found this to be an aggressive response to knight f3. Maybe not the most like, high-level response, but the idea is to play e5, and then what, 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 what? He, he wants to play the bond cloud? What is this? How do I punish him? I want to punish him to the maximum. e4 immediately. Let's play d5. Okay, this is this is bogus. He's going to play king c3. Where's my mate? Queen, queen f6 is a move. Bishop b4 is a move. Maybe bishop. Yeah, bishop b4. I'm taking this seriously. Bishop b4. Thinking about d4 first. Now let's just take the knight first. Because now d4 he won't be able to take with his knight. Now knight a5. <sighs> People these days. Is c5 going to be mate? <laughs> that was nice. This actually reminds me of something I've seen before. L let me give up a, a puzzle, just a funny like brain teaser puzzle for the viewers. Um, let's go back to the starting position. Um, so the puzzle goes like this. White gets to make seven moves in a row from move one. Black makes one move and it's checkmate. Now I'm going to go ahead and, sh and show the solution. And I'm, I'll probably post this on YouTube later. So if you're watching on YouTube, feel free to pause the video and try and figure out the solution. White makes seven moves from starting position. Black makes one move and it's mate in one. Um, the solution is d3. King locks one, two, three, four. Wait, d3 was one. So that's five moves. And then white plays b4 and a4, and then black plays c6 mate. So that kind of reminded me of, uh, of this sort of mate. 